Get Rich Slow with John Wolf. So one question I get kind of often is, how do I find a great real estate agent? And honestly, that's a really hard thing to answer. It's really hard to answer that abstractly. The best answer I could honestly give you is, come talk to me, we'll talk about what you want to do, and I'll find you somebody in our area who's really good at it. But if you kind of want to know how to do it in general, here's how. Um, and it's really tough. And the main reason is that anybody in a profession can do like the easiest version of the thing that profession normally does. The tough thing, both from the client and the professional standpoint is a lot of deals start really easy and then they get tough. So the only reason I know that certain real estate agents personally are very good is I have done multiple transaction with them that got difficult and then seeing how they engaged and went be above and beyond to fix the situation or crumble is how I actually know they're good. Um, the other thing is what do they actually specialize on or with? So I know several real estate agents that really specialize in some of the unique needs and benefit programs that veterans can do. I know some real estate agents that I personally trust to do uh, multifamily purchases, uh, you know, fourplex, threeplex, that sort of thing. And I know some just tenacious real estate agents that I want on somebody's side if they are a first time buyer with not a lot of resources. Now, once you get into the category of buyers where you know, you're a buyer, you've got good credit, stable income, you can easily purchase something that you like within your pre-approval limit, then it's a lot easier to find a real estate agent that's gonna serve you well or okay, and it becomes way more about personality. Not that the personality of the specialist is any more important, but generally speaking, I would go towards people who seem to actively specialize in the type of client you are or what you're doing. And I would run away from the kinds of real estate agents who will tell you that they're an expert in everything. Um, it's totally natural for a real estate agent to do, you know, some buyer side and some listing, but it would seem a little bit improbable for someone to tell you, oh yeah, I specialize in all of Oregon and Washington. And you know, I do first time home buyers and specialize in $5 million plus jumbo homes. You know, Claims like that doesn't make sense. So just to sort of give you an idea of what I've decided to do in my own career. So I've decided to super specialize in first time home buyers and I've decided to super specialize in multifamily and everything in Oregon and Washington only, and really only in the Vancouver, Portland area. Now I can do easy anywhere in Oregon and Washington, but I have no interest in doing, you know, loans in California or Idaho. I don't have any interest in learning how to do construction loans. Um, you know, there's a whole bunch of facets of the industry that take a lot of effort to actually be good at. And you really do need to narrow your scope a little bit. Um, and again, easy is easy. Every guy, gal, loan officer, real estate agent can help with a simple, straightforward purchase or refinance or something like that. It's when things go wrong or when things are very complicated up front where skill level really matters. Hope that helps a bit. Uh, share, like, and subscribe if you have any questions. And I support my own family by doing home loans in Oregon and Washington. So if you want help or advice or just see what I can do for you, give me a call, reach out. Talk to you later. Bye.